Hey, I'm Beppard, that is Ultra Puppy, and you are watching one of my videos. Let's get into it. So today has been really rough for me. Just like all around bad day, which, you know, is sad. So I'm hoping that this new Animal Jam update will kind of cheer me up because usually they do. So let's go ahead and grab the first page of news. Polar Arctic foxes. Oh, wow. Okay. Polar Arctic foxes have come to Jama. Previously thought to be a myth. These rare animals are rumored to have beautiful fractal frost patterns on their fur and a trail of snowflakes that follows them as they walk. There's no telling how long these super cool animals will be in Jama, so be sure to become one today. I am, because you know what? You know what? I'm gonna tell you what, once I remember what I was gonna say. Oh yes, the arctic fox is my favorite animal in the entirety of Animal Jam, and so, you know, I just kind of need to be one. Buy for 10 diamonds. Oops, not a goat. I don't want a goat. I don't want any goat in my life. I don't want a goat. This looks so weird right now. Like, I don't know what I'm staring at, but it is not me. I need to, like, hurry up and get my items on there because it's kind of freaking me out. There we go. And now I am me. All right, awesome. But what pattern do I want? Ooh, that's kind of magenta-y. Ooh, what should I do? Ooh, I don't know. I kind of like that one because it's magenta-ish, but it's also, like, really pink and purpley. So I'm at Ooh, I'll just go with that one. That's, like, really subtle but also awesome. And, like, snowflakes follow me as I walk, which is awesome. So there we go. New look achieved. Explore Quiet Moon 2.0. Awesome. And next up we have this. The Temple of the Ancients. The vines that have previously blocked its entrance are gone, which means the Temple of the Ancients has opened its doors. Oh my god. I don't know why I'm doing that voice. This incredibly old stone structure lies at the center of the Belouche and invites jammers to learn more about the ancient animals that came before them. Ooh, so we're gonna learn about dinosaurs and stuff. Let's go see. I want to go see right now. All right, so it's up here. Oh, look at that trail of snowflakes. That's so cute. So I guess I just go in. Yes, I do. Ooh, let's explore. Okay, it's very... I love the trail of snowflakes. Just look at that. Look at it. I love it. Okay. Um, what's this? Do I just click on it to learn about it? Yes. Extinct animals. A fossil is created when the remains of a plant or animal are preserved inside stone. Once those remains dissolve, the spot they leave behind is filled by minerals that take the same shape and form a natural mold. Oh my god, look at those things. They're like huge tusk things. Wow. Okay, what's this? Ooh, wow, look at that jaw. This is cool. We're learning about dinosaurs. All right, what's over here? Let's go down here. Ooh, whoa, that's cool. That's pretty. It's like blindingly clear. This, this, this place, I like it. I like it a lot. Ooh, there's an egg. I want to, I want to have the egg. Is there a store in here? There better be a store. Oh my God, what is this? What? An ancient helmet? Yes. Ancient amulet? Yes. Ancient tail armor? Uh, yes, some ancient whatever the heck this is. Just ancient armor. Just regular old ancient armor. Yes. Ancient gauntlets. Yes. Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, wow. Look at this place. It's beautiful. And look at me. I'm not so beautiful. Look at my tail armor. Oh, my God. That is horrifying. That is, that is terrifying. My tail armor is so blocky and just large. And I don't like it at all. I do not enjoy that. I need to get my outfit back. Okay, we're back in action. Oh my god, look at the little snowflake under me. I mean, that's not a little snowflake. It's a, a rather large snowflake, but oh, that's so cool. And look, there's more thingies. Oh my god, it's a tiger. I love tigers. Let's read about it. Extinction means that a species is gone forever. It can happen for all kinds of reasons, from huge changes in the planet's temperatures, aka global warming, to destruction of a habitat. Animals that are considered endangered are under protection to prevent them from going extinct, such as tigers. Wow, you learn something new every day. What about this? Oh, wow, that's an ugly fish. I don't want to read about it. I mean, it's a beautiful fish, but not for me. Ew, what is that? Ew. Wow. So that's like an entire place. I love the water. It's so, like, crystal clear and awesome. Nice. Oh, and look, they decorated it for the month of March. Look. Look at that. That's so cute. Oh, look at this. This is cute. I love it. I love it. I love it. It's a good, it's good. I enjoy. 10 out of 10. Okay, the next thing in the update is, ooh, we got some lucky stuff. Do you need somewhere to display your riches? Uh, yeah. I have 6 million gems. Get on my level. I'm being sarcastic, by the way. I don't need anywhere to display my riches. Do you want to show your passion for rainbows? Yes. 
the Lucky Castle has got you covered. Awesome, that's uh, returning, but I think I may have recycled mine, so I might have to buy another one. And Lucky Clovers, embark on Jamal's springtime adventure and try to collect enough Lucky Clovers to open treasure chests. Nice. So both of these things have returned. Uh, they're not very new, so I'm not going to go much more in depth with that. And next we have Dash Tag. Dash Tag is out now. Run, slide, jump, and dash your way through this endless runner game from Wildworks. Catch up to rare pets and tag them as you play. Tons of jammers have already checked out this new game, and you can too. It's available now for Apple and Android mobile devices, and you can download it today for free. I'm going to give you a little tiny review on this game. I love it. I'm obsessed with it. I have 97 out of the 100 pets, and I have almost all of the achievements achieved. Like... I'm almost completely done with this game because I've just been obsessing over it. Like, I play it every spare second I have. It does glitch a tiny bit sometimes. Like, if you watch an ad, it might still keep, like, running your animal in the background and you might just die and then you'll have to use, like, more emeralds or watch another ad. So it's, like, kind of weird sometimes. But for the most part, it's a really fun game. It's really great. The graphics are amazing. They have a lot of different things you can hope to achieve. You can like level up your animals. You can go for the achievements. You can try to catch new animals. Like a bunch of stuff. Like it's not just like you're running. It's like you're actually doing and achieving a lot of different things in this game. So if you want something fun and addicting, get Dash Tag. Next up we have the Ancient Armor, which I discovered in the little area place. The, uh, the, the temple. Yeah, the tail armor is weird. I don't I don't know what that's all about. Look at my tail armor. But the other stuff's pretty cool. Ancient armor has been discovered within the wall of Belushes. <sighs> I just yawned. Ancient armor has been discovered within the walls of Belushes Temple of the Ancients, and it's available now. Also, more mannequins have arrived. Cheetahs, deer, cougars, and Clydesdale horses are waiting to be decked out in new fashions. Well, that's just dandy now, isn't it? And I think there's something about the alphas right here. Ooh, call of the alphas. Look at all of them looking so happy. We got Mr. Plant Man, the one Julian's obsessed over, the one that always takes pictures of you, my boy, my man, Greeley, Mr. No Eyebrows, and Demon Bunny. Hidden through this party are new items that the alphas use in their fight to protect Jama. Whenever you see an item, click on it to learn more in your journey book. If you find them all, you'll earn special prizes. Be sure to keep your eyes on the party list to join the next Call of the Alphas. That's pretty cool. I've already been to that party. I got the journey book, and it's a pretty cool prize, let me just say. All right, Lucky Day. Spring has sprung, which means Lucky Day is back. This annual holiday reminds us how lucky we are to live in such a green world, so join the celebration. And Lucky Items. Lucky Day means plenty of lucky items are back. Keep your eyes out for them and get ready to go green. Wow. A new chapter. The Alphas discover an ancient treasure map in the Chamber of Knowledge and set sail to follow it. Read all about their adventures in the 4th AJ chapter book. I'm excited because I love these books actually. They're amazing and fun and easy to read and just nice. Also, I remember reading them at VidCon last year and that was a fun time. So yeah, I'm just, I'm excited all around for this new chapter. Pretty exciting. And I think that's it, except there's also another new thing about Dash Tag here, which is weird. They literally have the same exact update, like, twice like literally the exact same okay oh well anyway uh this update has been a solid six out of ten it was fun it was educational a little bit because you know the dinosaurs and stuff i got to create a new outfit out of snowflakes and that was wicked fun one thing i wish they could have added is just like more clothing items because i really just kind of want a store in Belouche. like we have this store but it's not like a store store. It's not like a store where items are being updated a lot or anything like that. Like, in Mount Shavir, we have that one standalone store. In Serapia Forest, we have the theater, so that's fun because there's always new videos. Coral Canyons, you have your epic wonders, so that's always being changed out. Crystal Sands is, you know, a fun place with a bunch of water slides and stuff like that. And, like, um, little shakes or whatever they are and it's like kind of a trading place so that's fun down here in the temple of zios we have you know the like zios temple area thing and that's fun to go into because you get to do the adventures through that and stuff like that Jama township i mean it has everything appendale obviously has the conservation center and also the pet place so all of the lands kind of have their purpose you know they have their thing that kind of defines them i mean mount shavir is the only one i can think of that doesn't really because nobody really goes there to trade or anything like that but it is like kind of the place where everyone just goes to hop all the time and it's kind of a hangout spot but the latest two lands Kimbara and Belouche I feel like 
they're awesome lands. They look really pretty and stuff like that, but they just don't have a lot of items, and I'm kind of hoping to see that more in Belouche. Like, so far we have that one area where you can buy, like, fossilized stuff, and then if you go into the temple, you can buy, like, ancient armor. The thing is, though, there's only, like, one page of items per store. Like, usually when a new party is opened on Animal Jam, there's, like, items you can get at that party, and there's only, like, one page of those items. In Kimbara and Belouche, there's only, like, one page of items in each store in that land. So it's kind of just, like, having like a mini party kind of thing. Like they're not really stores and I kind of wish that they'd, you know, work with that more. That they'd make some more like stores or more items to go in the store. So hopefully they do that in the future because I'd definitely like to see more of that. But that's my only critique for this little um, update and hopefully we get something really exciting next time. And anyways guys, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. This video kind of has cheered me up. I feel better than I was feeling. So that's exciting. And anyways guys, Good. Love you. Bye. Ooh, I'm a rebel just for kicks. I've been feeling it since 1966. Man.